Hey everyone, <clears throat> this is a short video about Canon wireless triggers using the um, the line of sight functionality within the standard uh, strobes that you get. And I'm just going to show you very quickly what I do for objects. So my base unit, I have 600 EX RT speedlight. It's pretty good. Uh, so I have it set to ETTL in master mode. Okay, and I have my camera on AV, and I'm going to make some changes here. 8 ISO 400, and I have an older Canon flash that's set up as slave. You have to make sure they're all in the same channels. Okay, the power difference is a lot on this one. This is a 420EX. And the key thing is you have to make sure that they're line of sight lined up. So make sure you need to have make, make sure you have a blinking dot here. And this blinking dot within the line of sight of the sensor on the main master flash. Okay, so then I have over here, and this is somewhat overkill, but I'm just trying to show you what I'm doing here. A Canon 580EX, again, less power than the main flash. And ignore these radio things, but I'm just showing you the line of sight functionality for the Canon here. Again, they need to see each other. I happen to have a Kershaw Skyline laid out on just a white cloth. I have the 100 millimeter lens going and I'll show you what I'm doing. I'm angling this one straight forward. I could angle it up to diffuse it a little bit. I have all the flashes going straight to it basically. So I have this eBay radio transmitter on here and since I'm doing macro um, I would prefer not to touch the uh, actual camera so I got this little remote control and we're gonna see if the flashes go off. Okay, so pretty good. You, the thing with these things is you're going to have to do a lot of trial and error to get the perfect balance of uh, flash. You can play with the ratios and all those things, but it is a little bit uh, difficult and time consuming. The other thing is you can struggle with the, the, uh, the batteries in the flash. If you um, don't have a fully charged battery, you can kind of affect things a little bit. If you're going to shoot something really important, make sure you replace all batteries and all your flashes that you're going to use before you start. Um, what else? I would say... So just like that, that's how I do uh, wireless strobes with a Canon. Okay?